What's up, you guys? Welcome back. A long time no see. So if you see. guys follow me on my Instagram, well, most of you may know, and most of you may not know, um, I did move out my parents' home. Yes, I am living independently. So I did one live on my Instagram. I did like a whole empty apartment tour, show up you guys the place and everything. So that was the reason I haven't been posting because there's just been a lot going on. Mostly good but bad as but, well um, it's been kind of like a kind of like a journey lately and um i haven't really had the time to really sit down and do videos for you guys um because of that because of me moving you know it's just a lot um but i am ready to come back and continue doing videos for you guys um, um so i thought i would come back with like a what's in my purse video for you guys because i know you guys love my old school videos they are my most viewed videos on my channel so i thought i would do one for you guys what a better way to come back with an old school so video. i will go more in depth into um my whole moving situation in like a separate video because i do want to do like a chit chat glam sit down kind of like q a video for you guys so i'll be talking more about that in that but video. besides that i am just so excited to be back and just talking to you guys again because i did miss you guys and even though i was gone i did see a lot as well so thank you guys so so much for being patient with me and continue giving me the love and support i appreciate every single one of you guys but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed today's, vid today's video and if you're new to my channel hi my name is marie thank you so much for clicking on today's video and if you're an oldie but a goodie thank you so much for coming back and also if you have not yet subscribed to my YouTube channel girl what are you waiting for hit that subscribe button also make sure you hit that notification bell as well so be notified of all of my future uploads and yeah without further ado let's head and see what I keep in my bag this is how my bag looks like so this is by the brand Telfair I believe that's the brand of the bag but I got this bag at my local beauty supply store um, but I believe you can order this bag off of Amazon um I bought the bag for a $45 but on Amazon it is cheaper I think it's like $34 um, but this is the pink one with this bag they do have other colors but I went with the pink one because you know spring is right around the corner and I wanted more of a li lighter bag um this is more of a medium size bag but it does fit a lot inside and the material is more like a leather it's like a leather material and it has the Tell fair. <laughs> I'm blushing that word logo on in the front of it. But again, they do have it in other colors. They have it in green, they have it in like yellow, nudes, any color you would want. But again, I'm with the lighter pink. Um, and also it has like a long shoulder strap, which you can use as like a crossbody or just over the shoulder, which I mostly use. But then also you have the like the um, handle as well as your preference so it depends of how you want to wear the bag if you want it crossbody or just want to um, hold it in the handle the, um, i will say this bag it's not like a cheap bag but the material of the bag it is cheap um i will say that it's one of those bags i don't think you can put so much inside because it will like the handles could like kind of rip and stuff like um, that so I try going light because you guys know me when I have a big bag I put a lot of stuff in my bag if you watch my other what's in my purses videos I can carry a lot of crap with me but they're like the things I need um, that I keep in speaking my bag speaking of that I did not throw anything in this bag just for the perfect purpose of the video these are the things that I have to have with me and the things that I do carry in my bag um, so yeah I did not just throw anything just for the purpose you of guys the video that but um Starting with the outside of the bag, I have this pump pump foam um, ball. This is just like a white color. I thought the white go really well with the pink. But anyways, let's go ahead and unzip the bag so I can actually show you guys what is inside the but bag. But this is how the bag looks like. The inside of the bag is black and like I said, it's pretty big and stressy. So you can definitely put a lot of stuff in there. So the only thing that I don't have in my bag that I'm missing is like tissues. Um, because I ran out, I haven't repurchased tissues because I always have to have tissues because I have like bad allergies and my eyes always watering, so I have to have tissues with me. And also, I normally keep snack in my bag, but I don't have any at the moment. But these are the only thing that I will not show you guys. But today. Um, besides that, everything else is what I carry. So with this bag, you have the main big compartment 
but you do have like a side pocket um but basically what i keep in the side this pocket is a key i just throw that in there but anyway um, so the first thing that i have in my bag is this little case um this is just to keep like the little things that don't be floating around my bag and if you guys watch my poshmark makeup mystery box you guys saw that i did got this little makeup bag but i don't use it as a makeup bag i just put like the little essentials that i don't want to be floating around my so the bag. first thing i will show you guys that i have in there is band-aid so this is just the old school brand band-aid i have to have band-aids in my bag because i'm always like hurting myself um so this is like a must have for me just the travel pack and then the next thing i have is a bunch of uh, lip glosses and lip balms like i am a lip junkie you guys know that so the first thing that i have this is right here me. so this is by nakay makeup and this is their lip therapy um this is so so nice it's kind of like a lip balm slash lip gloss like it's very moisturizing and smooth on the lips um but it's also kind of give you that mirror glossy look as well but it's like a lip balm so yeah i love love this i've purchased like a lot of this the past couple of, um months it's so so good so i have to have this in my bag um and then i have this lip gloss this is by ruby kisses and this is your jellyish um lip gloss so this has mango butter and i say berry i think that's how you pronounce but it but this is basically a red lip gloss that kind of just give you like a little bit of red tint to the lips so i just have that and then i have this broadway ultra lip coconut oil this lip is gloss. the best lip gloss you guys i love the formula of this because a lot of lip glosses at the drugstore could be very sticky but this is not sticky like it's so smooth moisturizing hydrating on the list it is so shiny but without being too sticky i just love this lip gloss and with this lip gloss they have other ones as well you can find this at like the beauty supply and then store. the next thing is my favorite lip balm this is the baby lip lip balm and this is the quenched quenched kind um this is just the original one and then the next thing that i have is i have this powder in here um this is just by kiss and this is their cover care cream foundation i powder. love this you guys like on those days i don't feel like wearing makeup like if i'm going to church but i want a little bit of something with my face or if i'm just going out in general i want to look kind of like presentable if i found out i'm going somewhere and i need to look presentable something like that then i love this because powder. it's like a cream powder foundation that dries to like a matte finish but that is super super full coverage so yeah i just have to have this in my um bag and then it comes with the sponge in a mirror so it's it's very compact and if you guys wearing the shade this is the shade cappuccino and the next thing that i have in my bag is i have my eye drop because i have really bad allergy my eyes always burning itching and just a lot going on so i have to have my allergy eye drops it's a must have for me and then the next thing that i have in the bag is i have these makeup remover wipes this is like a must have for me because when my lipstick kind of budges i want to like take it all off i use this or if i need to clean like my eyeliner or something or if i need to remove my makeup which never happened but i use it for like lip purposes and um, this is just the neutrogena makeup remover wipes it's a must have for me and i always have to have the little travel side and then i have this little case right here which i actually got off of sheen and basically what i keep in here is just my tiny nose um it just looks better like more presentable because a lot of time nobody gotta know that you're taking tiny nose because if you just pull this out nobody gonna know what is in here so i just like to have this um because I get really really bad cramps and headaches and um, having time on all with me is a must have um, especially when I'm on my period so I just keep it in this little that I got off the of Shein and then the next thing that I have is a mascara this is the L'Oreal Voluminous Cumberland Black Mascara I love love this mascara you guys it's the best mascara the reason I have this in my bag because mascara is the thing that I do last and I'm always forgetting to put mascara on um, so I just like to have like a backup in here and also if I need to touch up during the day then I have like a backup and then in last here. but not least the last thing I have is actually my bag. compact mirror every girl gotta have this in their bag but yeah I just have my compact mirror you know gotta check if you know the mascara is going everywhere gotta check what's going on so yeah I like to have so that, was that. Everything so that was in the little bag so continue with the bag the next my thing bag. I have is my wallet 
I loved it you guys this is just so perfect for me because it's not too big it's like the perfect size but this is by the brand forever Sh forever fashion that's the brand I got this at the rainbow store um, but basically what I have like here. two receipts in here um, from Walgreens because I shop at Walgreens a lot um, but let's see what tatties, I got I got it um, mac and cheese and then I got it a Febreze air spray. The grocery lifestyle. The next thing that's oh, I have this receipt. This is actually my bank receipt because I had to um fix something, so I had that in there. And then the next, and then when you open it, and then open it like this. So when you open it like this, you have these three pockets right here. You can't really fit anything in this pocket, but I keep my debit card and my credit card here. No, um, so yeah, you can actually put cash, but I have no money because all of my money goes to my rent and bills. No, I'm kidding. I, I had money in there, but I've used I'm it on grocery all. shopping. And then the next thing that I have in my bag, which is a must have. If you guys been watching my wife's in my purses, you guys know I love keeping baby wipes in my bag. I know I sound kind of awkward, but I love baby wipes, you guys. They're just... They just better for me. I don't know. I just I've love been baby loving wipes. this brand. This is the Well Beings brand. This is the flushable baby wipes. I just like to have this in my bag um, for when I like, you know, when I finish the bathroom. I like to wipe down there, and also if I need to wipe my face, um, you know, anything like that. Then I like to and I like have it because these. it's small and compact. It's not too big. Um, but yeah, I love love this and it's perfect if you have sensitive skin since I've been using it I haven't really had any problem with sensitivity. Um, so yeah, I love those wipes And then the next thing I have in my bag, which is my must-haves in my bag is body care item This is like my must -have. the first thing so, that I have is a little mini travel deodorant This is by suede and this is a 24-hour protection. Deodorant. I love 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 this deodorant It smells so so good the tropical paradise um scented one but i like to have a deodorant here i like to have a deodorant in here for when i forget to put it on if i'm just like running out the door i forgot to put it on and also if i need a touch up during the day especially spring is coming so this is like a must have and then i have lotion which is not a surprise um, when i wash my hair when i exercise my hair my hair can be very dry and also if my legs are dry it's just kind of looking ashy um then i like to have lotion um with me and i've been loving this um jergen sweet Chris crystal lotion this smells really nice it's very fruity if you like orange and um lemon together then you really, really just like this since in general but yeah i have to have a lotion with me and it's a must have and yes i keep like a bigger bottle in here because it lasts me longer than like a travel size and then keeping a line on that i also like to keep a little body spray so this is by Sipping glory and this is just their fragrant spirit zit this is basically like a body spray slice i guess like fragrance um, but if you guys know the soap and glow -ish, um rashes body body butter this smells just like this but like in a body spray um form this smells so so good and i noticed with this scent it really does oh it smells so good it really really does lather so it kind of lasts really really long um throughout the day but i have to have a body spray with me just to touch up and um yeah so i have a body spray because you guys know it's a must have for my bag another thing that i have in my bag the last two thing in my bag this video was not long whatsoever. but the last two thing i have in my bag is a hand sanitizer you guys know i have to have this um in my bag because before i eat i like to sanitize my hand um, I'm always sanitizing my hand and that's why they're always dry but my favorite hand sanitizer to use you guys know is the pure well hand sanitizer this is like the only hand sanitizer I use because I truly believe it really helps like the body body hand sanitizer they smell really really nice but I don't think they do anything I think they're just there for the scent not to be kind of like rude or anything but I just love the pure well hand sanitizer plus it's like the number one brand hand sanitizer in the hospital so yeah I just have to have a hand sanitizer with me to to synthesize these hands and then that, the next thing which is the last thing in my bag is actually icebreaker i normally really have gum in here but i don't have any gum in here but i love these you guys because i've been eating a lot of 
Okay, this is gonna sound kind of awkward, but I've been eating a lot of like garlic, like garlic chip. Like you guys know how garlic breath can be, and it's the most unattractive thing in this world. Like especially if I'm like I haven't eaten anything before I go to church, I'll be having like garlic um chip in here. And you guys know how garlic breath can be like. And plus, I'm always hugging like the pastor, and I'm always like hugging you know the loved ones and stuff like that and talking to them after church and you don't want to have that golden bread it's really un unattractive yeah i just so. like to have icebreaker mints in here and they're so so good and they really do get the job done so yeah i have to have that that is it for today's video that was everything that i kept in i hope bag. you guys enjoyed today's video make sure if you did enjoy it please give me a huge thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe before you and, um, leave. Yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I love you guys so, so much as always. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.